best version of myself will never probably be fully realized, but it's the pursuit of that best version that makes me feel fulfilled. Me and Caden met when we were both kids, but we didn't really become friends till we started making things together. We kind of bonded over creating things, and that's when it became a real friendship. My name's Caden, and this is Logan. Yep, yeah, I'm Logan, and we're the Blacksmith Boys. So we're based out of Mission BC, which is in the Fraser Valley, about an hour and a half from Vancouver. We were kind of broke as kids, so when you can just get scrap and make all the tools you need, that is a fantastic way to start a hobby. One of our first things that we needed to make was a forge. So we took my bedside table that I had in my room and we put some clay on it, added a pump, and we were off to forging. Voila, fire. <laughs> We've upgraded since then. The forge is the heart of the blacksmith shop. It is the platform that basically holds your fire and holds your heat. I can typically get the forging done really fast, and he has the patience to make it look nice at the end. So that's really complimentary. And also our sense of humor, because working with someone that you can't laugh with is just the worst thing in the world. <laughs> I have no idea what you're on about. One of our favorite pastimes is butting heads. So I think we end up typically doing a lot better because there's no yes man in our kind of relationship. Typically the best ideas float to the surface. We are pretty outgoing, so making videos and things like that really kind of fits in to what we're yeah. doing. Creating a social media account, that's kind of what really got us going. We also try and film entire projects from like start to finish. We've had a few people contact us just by watching videos, asking us to make these cool new projects. We make most of our money just through lessons. There's nothing better than someone from your city coming out here and going, hey, you know this piece of garbage? You can make it into a really functional, beautiful tool. And with just a little bit of know-how, anyone can do it for almost any amount of money. So- I mean, we did. Yeah, we did. That's how we started. As far as the uh, future of my finances is concerned, growing up with not having access to excess, I don't have any desire to be fantastically wealthy. And my uh, goals just to be stable, I think is very, very reasonable and obtainable. This year, we made the foundations for the future of both our blacksmithing careers. 